Recently, I found a channel on YouTube that I think is pretty hilarious, so naturally, I'm gonna steal all their content for views. Seriously though guys, it's a pretty underrated channel, at least in my opinion. They only have 50,000 subscribers, and while that is a pretty big number, I think they deserve more. So before we do anything, I'm gonna let you know, there's a link down below, go subscribe to the channel, go watch some of their videos, give them some views. They're trying to get monetized on YouTube right now, and uh, that's gotten a lot more difficult lately, so I think they've been waiting like 10 months for YouTube to review their channel, and that really sucks, so show them some support. The channel I'm talking about here, guys, is Dog Beef, video edits and memes. Now, I kind of have a love-hate relationship when it comes to uh, YouTube poops. I like YouTube poops, but the problem I have with them is that they get really, really obnoxious. There's a lot of distortion and things that I don't think make a video better. And I like this guy's content because it's just straight up re-edited videos. He takes videos, he re-edits them, so <laughs> so something completely different is going on, and um, it's just it's just hilarious. I've only watched a few videos, but I can tell that I'm gonna enjoy most of them. The most recent upload is from two days ago, and it's called Jack Septicai is a furry. So this is a re-edit from uh, the H3 podcast that Jacksepticeye was on. I haven't seen that episode yet. I do plan on watching it, but uh, yeah, let's see what this is about. Jacksepticeye, Sean McLaughlin. That's me. <laughs> How's your sex life? I would definitely f*** you. Did you get her consent? Dude, I got, I got issues. You don't get your baby seat done? <laughs> he makes it really awkward. He adds in all these like scenes where nobody is saying anything and it's just great. Like, have you guys seen the um, Dr. Phil, but it's awkward, that kind of thing? I love those those kind of videos. Just just straight up edits, you know, don't add anything stupid in there. Just just mess with it. So you're you are close friends with uh, Mark, Markiplier, right? No. <laughs> What's the first <laughs> guys I, I gotta let you know I I'm, I'm cutting a lot of this out There's a lot of funny stuff here, but it's like super inappropriate and I try and keep my videos Family friendly. What's the first? Uh, what's the first nice thing you bought when you started getting that cheddar cheese at guacamole? I bought an iPad mini Same. to watch furry porn videos in bed and you were living with your parents Yeah, how did your parents feel about the furry <laughs> porn? I mean, my parents have always kind of been supportive. They're good. Almost, almost to a fault. They're one of the good ones. Mm. Yeah. I mean, if that's what you're into. Maybe that's what people think is going on. But does that mean you want to f*** animals? No, that's the, that's the thing about it. It's like there's so much, like, intricacy to it. Mm. It's like, no, I just want to f*** somebody else who's dressed as an animal. Oh. Well, now I get it. I, I, you know, it took me a long time to understand furries, guys. I didn't quite know what was going on, but now that Jacksepticeye has revealed his love for furries, I'm a little bit more accepting, you know? This one right here is a gem, guys. I mean, you can tell which ones I've watched. I watched the Kanye West one, and I watched the Jordan Peterson one. Jordan Peterson's controversial diet. You're on this carnivore diet yes, now. Do you take any vitamins? Nope. No, I eat tiny infants and salt <laughs> and water. <laughs> this exactly. one just works so well, you know? Because, I mean, if you, if, you, if you fiddle with the camera angles enough, you can make people say pretty much anything, you know? But, uh, yeah, this one just flows so good. I love it. And I, and I almost believe it. You know, Jordan Peterson says some weird stuff sometimes. He's on this diet where he only eats meat. I wouldn't be surprised if he eats small children. No, I eat tiny infants and salt and water. That's it. And I never cheat, ever. The kids are, kids are uh, getting killed. Killed all of them, rounded them all up, <laughs> killed them, them, stole all their property, sent the remnants to Siberia, froze them to death. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting white people overall so like if you're a black man you end up dead look we need systemic racism everywhere this is the you that i understand what about the fact that you're <laughs> fat and stupid yeah <laughs> you absolute son of a bitch <laughs> i love how it ends with that you absolute son of a bitch this guy has to be like number one guy to take out of context and with joe rogan Joe Rogan just has the best replies. Uh-huh. Yeah. This is the you that I understand. You could just you could you could put that on on anything and it would be hilarious. Question is, guys, what are Dog Beef's most popular videos? Well, his number one video is <laughs> Jack Septicai ignores crying fan. Yes, I've already watched it. Uh, I want to watch it again. It's just that good. Adele, the singer, has over 16 million subscribers on YouTube. The next guy you're about to meet an Irish fellow, has over 18 subscribers. Whoa. This is what he does. 
Wow. You know, I, I got mad respect for dog beef for finding those clips. I mean, how long did it take? Probably, no, probably not that long to find clips of Jack just straight up screaming at a game. But still, you know, it's, it, it, it took some time. All right, you might not have heard of him, but to millions, he's kind of a big deal. Would you give a welcome, please, to Sean McLaughlin, also known as Jack Septicai, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> so awkward. Nobody is clapping. Nobody cares about you, Jack. Hey, where's Adam? Adam Moon is, is here. Hi, Adam. Hi. <laughs> This is so good. I'm glad this video got 1.2 million views because it is hilarious. Actually, I find it really funny that 14,000 people dislike this video. That's the that's the Jacksepticeye fan base, the ones that don't understand jokes. They're like, man, my man Jacksepticeye didn't say that. My, the, the Jacksepticeye is the best boy. He would never, ever ignore a crying fan. I cried in front of Jacksepticeye and he hugged me. I have seen many people cry in front of Jacksepticeye because I've been there during some of his like meetups and stuff like that and he's always super cool about it, okay? Don't worry, it's just a joke. I really hope people don't take this literal. Crying laughing emoji. Yeah, they did. They did, they uh, yep. So many people probably clicked on this video like, no, it can't be. You're 14, you're from Wicklow, and you have a question. Uh, yeah, um, do you have any advice on, like, people starting YouTube channels, like, how to get more subscriber, subscribers to their channel? I don't know if I should say or not. <laughs> you can try. Uh, no, I, I, I'll keep that under wraps. Okay. <laughs> Check! Check why! So many people want to know how to get subs on YouTube, and Jack, the selfish son of a bitch, is, is just keeping it all for himself. Jack? Not cool. Uh, Jane Ann, how are you? <laughs> there she is. <laughs> he just laughs. <laughs> I don't know why I find this so funny, guys. It just is. Okay, I just. Mm. All right, what else we got here, guys? Ethan Bradbury ruins the H3 podcast. That sounds pretty good. That is your seat, by the way, Ethan. This is a podcast. Mo, can you take care of your brother? <laughs> this is already funny just because of the fact that Ethan Bradbury came on the, the uh, H3 podcast dressed up as Spider-Man. This is going to be really awkward, isn't it? Ethan, are you going to talk? Are you going to join us in conversation? Slamman! <laughs> Hot ones with Casey Neistat, but he just drinks water. Hey, what's going on, everybody? For First We Feast, I'm Sean Evans, and you're watching Hot Ones. It's the show with hot questions and even hotter questions. And today I'm joined by Casey Neistat. Can you repeat the question? <laughs> Guys, Hot Ones is a really cool show. I think I've had people ask me to go on the show. Um, one, nobody would want me on there. There's no two. Oh shit, guys, Casey Neistat commented on this video and said, this is my favorite video on YouTube. Whoa, all right. Milk? I thought he just drank water. His title is misleading. <laughs> it's just so awkward, man. So awkward. Again, guys, this is one of those videos where it wasn't just a couple of edits, but he also had to add in sound effects and stuff like that. Fantastic job. He has a whole bunch of videos that are called 
something, but it's awkward. This one is hot ones with H3, H3, but it's awkward. I mean, the, the Casey Neistat one was pretty awkward as well, <laughs> I would say. I hate my life. <laughs> I may puke. Now? <laughs> Vsauce acts weird on Jimmy Kimmel. All right. He makes educational videos on his YouTube channel called Vsauce. Please welcome Michael Stevens. <laughs> you let's pretend to eat each other but not swallow who does that just me <laughs> i don't think there's any context for why he just said wouldn't be super weird i haven't seen this interview so i can't say for sure but jesus man kids are amazing <laughs> Why do we kiss? <laughs> oh. oh my god. Alright, last one guys. I don't want to steal this guy's entire channel or anything, okay? Watch the videos yourself. It, it won't take very long. If you can watch me reacting to these things, you can go watch them too, okay? Do it. But last one, Ethan insults Dunkey on the H3 podcast. Video game Dunkey and Leah who are currently facing the wall. I feel like I'm in the Blair Witch Project. <laughs> they, you guys. All right. How you guys doing? Video game donkey. Probably takes a shit, cooks chicken without washing his hands. Oh, uh, no. Yeah. That takes a lot of compassion to take a human shit. <laughs> what? Yeah. I get it. There's a couple <laughs> hookers in in your pool, but it's okay because they're Chinese. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, shit. man. Yeah. This is probably the best thing in my life. Donkey is a psycho. <laughs> Cats are the leading killers of birds. You're an idiot. Get out. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that that was pretty good. That was pretty good, guys. If you can't tell. I really enjoy these videos. I genuinely think they're hilarious. I want to see more from this guy, so go show him some love. That was Dog Beef. Uh, thank you so much for watching, guys. Link down below in the description. Uh, subscribe. <laughs>